welcome to this video. Today we're going to look, take a look at the brainstem anatomy. And so what I've done here is I've modeled a 3D model of the brainstem and made it see through so that we hopefully better can, can understand where the more important structures are located. And this is not all the structures in the brainstem, but it's some of the more important ones. And so what we can sort of uh, see from this model is the outlines of uh, obviously the medulla oblongata, most inferior, with the pons in the middle and the mesencephalon, most superior. And the structure that we're going to be looking at is the different nucleuses found in the brainstem and uh, two important pathways and then two bigger structures that are also very important. So starting with the different nucleuses, um, I'll show them here, all labeled. So if you want to, you can just take a screenshot of this and then you can make flashcards or look at them later. I won't be going over them one by one, but you can just pause the video and look at them if, if you want to. Okay, let's move on and look at the last four structures. And again, I won't be going over these structures one by one, but what's important to mention is that the tractus corticospinalis will have its decusation uh, at the level of the medulla oblongata. Uh, that means that it will cross over to the other side, as you can see in the model. And uh, for the tractus spinothalamicus, it has its decusation or it crosses over at the level of the entry into the spinal cord, so it would be below the brainstem. That was it. Uh, let me know if there's any other structures you would like me to cover uh, from the brainstem. And uh, thanks for watching.